Hello, so let's continue our walkthrough of the Instro CSL. Uh, so today we're going to talk about the multiply output. Um, this has sort of a ring modulation mode, an AM mode, and a full rectification mode. Um, it has two inputs, and the sine waves are normal to the inputs. So if you plug nothing in, you get a sine wave from each of these oscillators. Obviously, we can use this circuit to plug in outside things. Um, this kind of sits next to my A times B plus C because they kind of work in that same way. As we turn this up, we'll get our volume, and you can hear the ring modulation happening. If we push the button, there's our AM. Full rectification mode. So you can get a lot of fun things happening. Um, you know, you take a sequence and plug it in. <laughs> and there's, you know, different options here if we link or don't link these. <laughs> okay, so different sounds to play with there. Another thing to note is we're not married to sine waves. We can have anything, so square waves if we want. Obviously, those are very different timbres. The nature of the circuit, too, is that the top is multiplied into the bottom, so um, the top has a pretty profound impact on timbre. Okay? Another thing to note, uh, the circuit can kind of function as a VCA because of the way depth is working. So if I plug an envelope in there... Just using the sign from the top and the um, envelope in the bottom. Same way it works the other way too. Okay, so if you're stuck in a pinch, um, this kind of can be a VCA for you too. Um, so I hope that gives you some ideas to play with.